natural aspiration. Guys, what's up? Welcome back to a fresh new inside series of this brand new Porsche Boxster GTS. 718 Boxster GTS 4.0. That's the full name they give this Boxster today. And why is it very special? Because the age of downsizing has encountered big engines 4.0. So yeah, this is a Boxster with a natural aspirated 4 liter engine. Porsche 4.0 natural aspirated flat six. That means this is the GT3 engine. No, sorry. This is actually as a base, the 991 engine. But this Boxster GTS might have all ingredients, well actually has all ingredients, to be the most desirable driver's car Porsche has. We have a mid-positioned engine, yeah, natural aspirated, yeah again, 4.0, holy moly, and stick shift, aka manual gearbox. Oh yeah, by the way, you can pop the roof. So yeah, that is no joke, that is no joke guys. All right, I have here the option list of the 718 Boxer GTS with the price list and all these specs of this nice green baby. Let's have a look. And of course, the end price, including all taxes in the Netherlands. If you're here for the first time, please tap the subscribe button and the bell notification. And that way you won't miss any of my new videos. Dutch option list, here we go, of the Porsche 718 Boxer GTS 4.0. So here we have the specific option and here we have some base options. So for example, we have the Porsche Torque Vectoring with the diff, we got the PASM, Sport Chrono Package, Sport Design Package, Sport Seats Plus GT Steering Wheel, Porsche PCM, and the Sound Package Plus. All right, the engine 4.0, so we got a four liter engine, that's pretty crazy for a Boxster. And we got a total power of 400 horses. So for this GTS with the base options, the base price is 124,796 euros. Full color name is Piton Green. The interior is all black with Alcantara. And the roof is also in black. Specific options, here we go, here we go. Got the interior package GTS, parking assistant including a camera, SWA, driver lane assistant, cruise control, seat heating, center rpm meter is in the color crayon interior package and the dash in leather and alcantara got the smokers package bose surround sound system apple carplay very handy if you're if you have an iphone we got a manual six-speed gearbox can i have an applause <laughs> save the manual thank you porsche next up led headlights including porsche dynamic light system pdls plus Porsche logos in gloss black as well. Of course, we got a full climate system. We got a light design package. We got the rain sensor adaptive sports seats in the front, multifunctional steering wheel, interior extra package for some leather and Alcantara in the doors. We got the steering wheel housing also in leather optional. Set nav Porsche Connect and we got DAB radio. Here we go. So, base price with the base options. Specific options, total end price in the Netherlands, including all taxes. Here we go. 145,221 euros. Yeah, that's a serious price for a Porsche Boxster. But it's the top model, it's the GTS. And you got a convertible as well. And you got a 4.0 engine. And you got a natural aspirated engine as well. So yeah, if you're asking me, the price range this is a bargain boxer gts let's start on the front so first of all we can definitely see how flat the nose is and definitely how also well porsche aggressive it is and from this angle it pretty reminds me of a career gt actually so currently enabled the day driving light so you have four leds there you go one two three four just like in the porsche 911 Inside you got your main LEDs, black chromed combinations in the whole headlight. So then below the front bumper, we have one big air unit where the air goes inside the bumper into the radiators. There you go. So we got also oil coolers and the radiators. Combinations with the piton green and the satin black here. We've got some two layers of satin black because also the splitter here finishing the whole lower side of the bumper. Park Pilots integrated 
cheeky in the front bumper and if we compare the front a bit to the 992 you can see here on the front hood that these lines are still rounded and on the 992 we got corner sharp angles okay let's continue to the front wheels michelin wheels 235 35 20 inch steel discs six pistons red porsche branded calipers and we got some metal discs drilled these have the optional satin black wheels well very nice combinations with the piton green okay, you got the fuel cap for the porsche <laughs> this is green as well Currently the roof is folded down, window trim also in the piton green and then here we go GTS 4.0 so we have a 4 liter engine in this mid engine positioned Porsche Boxster just like in the Cayman 4.0 engine mirror caps also in the piton green and down here finished in set in black Side intake, there we go, mid positioned engine. So we've got two air channels here, they're separated, definitely functional. Air entrance one, and on top, and here on top, we got air entrance number two. So, yeah, serious business here on the left and on the right, two air channels to enter air in the engine. This is also nicely finished in gloss black, nice contrasting with the interior and with the satin color of the black roof and also the leather finishing here in the interior. So you get some nice black combinations. The rear wheels, again Michelin's, now we have 265, 35, 20 inch, smaller discs but still drilled discs and we got four pistons of Porsche branded red calipers. These wheels are definitely very racy on this GTS. Very nice combo. And then the rear. Well, yeah, first of all, look at this the rear LEDs. In the center, we got a nice LED bar here. So we got two stripes of LEDs. And we got four points of LEDs as well, just like the front headlights. On the inside, this is all blacked out with some chrome of the light shapes. And also gloss black, by the way. There you go. So yeah, nice contrasting again with that green. Here we have the active spoiler. You can also control the spoiler from the inside. There we got it. 718 Boxer GTS. And then the rear diffuser, a serious diffuser for a car this size. But hey, we are talking about a 4.0 natural aspirated engine. Twin exhaust tips. Chrome black finish with the tailpipes and a nice satin rear diffuser. Well, if you look closely, you can see that we have two layers of diffuser here. Here's the first top and here's the lower part. Very aggressive, very aggressive. I like this. By the way, there's the rear camera. And if you look closely, below the rear spoiler, we also have in black Porsche here, written. So not contrasting, but it's still there. Was I right? The best looking boxer? It is, it is. Personally love this color as well. Okay, let's have a look at the trunk space. So this is interesting. The boxer has two trunks. Got the front trunk, but also a rear trunk. So there you go. Two buttons for the trunk controls. Front and rear. So front trunk we're used to be from. Porsches, there you go. 
pretty decent pretty decent i think this might be even bigger as a 911 or maybe the same anyway this is big this is big but then what you don't have in a 911 is this you got some rear trunk space as well it's my camera bag so you can compare this rear space to all the other cars and this is pretty decent as well and by the way here you can add your coolant and your oil engine oil so yeah very small solution from Porsche to give this car two trunk spaces because yeah it's a two-seater but if you want to go for a longer holiday or like a weekend trip you still need some some stuff for two persons so now we got two trunk spaces okay it's time to go inside okay entry tests but first don't forget the gts is lower than your regular boxer here we go yeah this is this is seriously low this is sports car supercar low actually welcome inside in the boxer gts this is your point of view well first bring some life here in this interior here we go here we go that's how we like it so if I compare this to the old Boxster, they have definitely improved finally the interior. So when I first got in this Boxster, my first impression was of the interior, finally Porsche, thank you. But why? Because the previous Boxster and the Cayman, that interior was very, there was a big distance between that car and the 911. And I believe if you're sitting in a Porsche, you need to feel the identity of the Porsche. So as mentioned, interior big time upgraded for this Boxster. Thank you, thank you very much. On the left, we got the light switches, but of course full automatic lights. We got again here, that nice carbon fiber trim that goes all the way through the interior. As classic on the left, we got the key ignition on the left side here. And here below of the lower side of the dash, we got Alcantara. So on top, we got that leather with that silver stitching and still here you can see that we have different kind of air vents in compared to the 911 here on top all black leather with their double silver stitching the sport chronometer this is very must have this is definitely so much Porsche this so nice how this is finished so high end I love this so on top of the dash all leather oh yeah and a very symmetric dash because in the center console you can clearly see that the left and the right side is mirrored so yeah very very symmetric steering wheel here we go full alcantara just like the 991 gts is also alcantara very nice we don't have shift pedals because because we have a manual gearbox guys six speed manual gearbox thank you porsche again thank you very much so again we got that nice porsche steering wheel just like in the 991s identical steering wheel with that nice finishes here and the controls on the left and on the right side inside this is also leather and here you got the controls for the car program the car modes speedometers well very much Porsche just like the 991s and on the right side there you got your digital display and the optional leather finish of the steering wheel housing there you go you can see it again with the double stitching okay let's have a look at the center console so yeah definitely a bit smaller cockpit than a 911 and we still have here a full touchscreen of the Porsche communication system there you go so this is not the same system as in the 992 this is actually the system from the 991 here below you got the controls for the climate system, two zone climate system of course, heated seats and then the manual gearbox guys with the perfect grip, perfect size, it's just perfect. 718 written here below as well to remind you. Here we got the controls to override some systems like the suspension, traction control on or off, the most fun button, the button for the rear spoiler, button to control the sport exhaust valves start subsystem and of course to fold down or to open the roof and by the way this is also housed in leather don't forget leather leather all the way 
Got a little extra here. There it goes, a red lighter, 12 volt input. Wow, this is this this is the smallest cigarette space ashtray I've seen in the car. Pretty cute. Okay, armrests. That's whoa, this is leather and this is Alcantara. So we've got two combinations. You open this from this side. There you go. We've got my personal items, just to prove BMW guys. And here we got, not to forget, USB input. And that's about it. Here you got the rear windshield. And by the way, here you go. Behind the seat, so this is again silver. We have also a speaker unit there. And yeah, we got some black carpeting as well. It's pretty cool how they have finished the seats. This handle as well. Porsche 718 Boxer GTS 4.0. Let's uh, let's continue talking while driving. cut the crap this is a car you need to drive you need to feel you need to hear it's a bit sharper than the Porsche 911 maybe that's because of the weight and because of the engine mounting it's a mid position engine yeah I think for this price range the competition is the BMW M2 comp or maybe even the CS but this with this mid position engine in its competition the GTS is definitely the boss I mean you can pop the roof can enjoy the view the music oh wow that you heard you hear that shifting that moment in an automatic gearbox you don't have the fun but now you enjoy the gears even more alrighty want well, to thank you for watching this inside series with a bit of driving series as well I hope you have some more feeling on the Porsche Boxster GTS. I mean, on features, it's definitely now fully spec to Porsche, especially from the interior. On driving, come on, man. Mid position engine, natural aspirated, I cannot repeat it enough. 4.0 engine with adaptive cylinder control. This is a driver's car. This is a true, true, true driver's car. Don't forget to give me a follow on Instagram. I'm gonna enjoy this a bit more with some driving. And I will see you definitely on the next video. Ciao!